Hey there, baseball card enthusiasts. Welcome back to Collecting Baseball Cards, the channel where we bring you all the tips and tricks to keep your collection in top-notch condition. In today's video, we're diving into a common problem faced by collectors everywhere. Curled baseball cards. Stay tuned till the end, because we've got some awesome methods to flatten those cards and restore them to their original glory. Let's get started, how to flatten curled baseball cards. The most common issue faced by baseball card collectors is curled cards. Over time, cards tend to curl at the edges due to moisture and improper storage conditions. This makes the cards difficult to store, display, and trade. There are some simple and effective methods you can use to flatten curled baseball cards and restore them to their original flat state. The first thing you need is a thick book that is larger in size than the baseball cards. An encyclopedia or phone book works well. Place the curled baseball card in the center of an page in the open book. Make sure the card is centered and there is space around all the edges when you close the book. The next thing you'll need is something heavy to place on top of the closed book to weigh it down. Heavy textbooks, a stack of other books, or a flat surface like a sturdy cutting board work well. Apply steady even pressure on the closed book. Leave the book and wait undisturbed for at least 48 hours. This allows time for the card to naturally flatten out through the pressure applied. After two days, carefully remove the weight and open the book. Check if the card has flattened out. You may need to leave it under pressure for longer if it is still curled, especially on very tightly curled older cards. Continue checking every 12 to 24 hours until the card lies completely flat. Once flattened, remove the card from the book carefully. For cards that are stubbornly curled even after prolonged pressure, you can use heat in addition to weight. Place the curled card in the open book as before. Then use a household iron on its lowest heat setting without steam. Pass the iron over the closed book, applying gentle steady heat for 30 to 60 seconds. Be very careful not to overapply heat or it could damage the card. Remove the iron and immediately close the book and weigh it down for 12 to 24 hours. As described earlier, the brief application of heat helps release the curled fibers before pressure flattens it out. Humidity can also be used to relax curled fibers and flatten stubborn cards. Place the curled card in a Ziploc bag with a damp paper towel. Close the bag tightly expelling all air. Leave it inside for at least 8 hours, allowing the humidity inside the sealed bag to soften the card stock. Then transfer the moistened card to a book with weights and flatten using pressure as usual. Be sure to dry the card thoroughly once flattened to prevent further moisture-related curling. For centering vertical or horizontal creases in cards, Inserts of wax or parchment paper can be used between the card and book pages in the problem areas while applying pressure. This prevents direct contact and enables the creases to flatten out uniformly. Take care while inserting and removing the additional pages or they may cause new creases. Proper ongoing storage is key to prevent recurrence of curled cards. Store cards in tight-fitting sleeves, sheets, or boxes without bending or warping them. Maintain a low and stable humidity level below 50% to minimize moisture absorption. Consider adding desiccant packs if humidity levels are problematic in your area. With some patience and correct technique, the above methods should help restore even your most. Severely curled baseball cards. Always handle your collectibles carefully during the flattening process. Excited about the world of baseball card collecting? Don't miss out on any future videos, subscribe now and join the fun.